hi guys welcome back to my channel step campus so in this video we are going to start our tutorial that is selenium with java okay and we are going to learn about first topic that is invoking browser invoking browser means how we are opening browser with the help of selenium okay so let's go to our ide okay so <coughs> we will open ide first okay just minimize this one minimize this one okay this is our id okay so uh, like in this id we are going to create first project okay just click on file okay and then we have to create new and then we have to create a project okay we have already created in previous lecture but yeah for uh, the new person like new people coming to this one like we will take some time to create a project and then we will see so project name will be I am writing selenium okay basics okay this is my project name okay and just click on next and then just click on finish okay so basics uh, this is my new project uh, okay now I am going to convert this one okay just let's convert it to the maven project okay and just click on next okay wait just make it cancel great not like this way okay so what we will do now we will create you know maven one so right click go to configure okay and just convert to maven project okay and the group id i will keep like step campus okay and selenium basics will be my artifacts id and just click on finish leave as it is all the things and just click on finish okay so now till here we have seen like why i'm uh, making this video now actually in previous video uh, there is some mistake uh, in creating that uh, pom.xml that's why i'm just uh, adding it again so that you can see this clear thing so guys like what we have did before now we have uh, installed some dependency in, in this one right uh, but we have implemented this independency after this version okay we have written code here but no in this video like like we no need to write here okay this is not a correct path to write we have to give this version that the dependency uh, beside this version okay just make sure the snapshot will be there for you as well for all the people okay so beside this version the beside this version snapshot version we have to give our dependency so let me create dependencies first okay and inside this dependency i will dependency is a plural okay and we will add uh, two dependency as of time but in later section maybe we require some more dependency that's why we are making as a plural dependencies and inside this dependencies we will add many dependency okay dependency is a singular okay let's see how we have created now you already know we have to go to this maven repository okay just copy this one open in a browser okay let's me open this browser okay now here we have to write selenium java okay just click on this one you already know this thing so i'm not going to explain this in everything just i am copying this one and i am setting up my project okay fine so you will see one thing uh, let me extract this one as well so as of now you are not getting any maven dependency right so you will get after this okay so again we have to add again we have to add test ng okay just go there click on this one click on the first link okay copy this one go there again paste it okay and scope part just make it comment okay like this way this one okay just cut this part and paste middle of this comment part okay so this is comment now save it so now once you save it now so you can see this maven dependency are automatically generated one folder so if you extract this folder so you can see there are dependency related to selenium and test ng okay so these things has a mistaken in the first lecture which we have uh, changed in this lecture so just make sure you have you have already these things but you have to just paste this dependency okay below this snapshot one snapshot version one okay not this version okay fine hope this is clear guys now we will go to our lecture and we will see the invoking browser okay now like whenever we are creating any test cases uh, with selenium with java na so we are creating everything in a class format okay 
java deals with a class so we have to create any any test cases in a class format so just click on src okay right click new and then click on class okay give the class name invoke underscore browser i am giving this name make sure the class name should start with the capital letter this is a good practice and just click on this public static word okay just check it and finish so you can see i just close this pomx as of now okay now you can see this one okay now here we have to write the code okay so what we are going to write the code now we are writing a code for invoking the browser okay fine so invoking browser already told you invoking browser means opening a browser so for this one we are uh, opening chrome driver the chrome browser so we will use chrome driver uh, method let's see so to deal with any method okay inside a class we, we have to create a object for that one okay so we are creating object object will be web uh, driver driver equals to new is a keyword to create uh, Put, uh, object okay and then we have to write chrome driver okay so this time you will get an error but not an issue we have to add some library for these things okay so for this also i have we ha i have given this to library just copy this one i will give this to introduction lecture okay and just paste there okay yeah fine okay so you see like uh, the error has gone so just follow this lecture okay you will understand like what we are going to do driver dot get okay so driver dot get it will take the url okay just give https www dot google dot com okay and then we will give some slip so this this is for slip okay okay if you're getting error just move the cursor there and just click on add throw declaration so you will see some lines of code here okay let's see okay so you can see here uh it's uh, the issue has gone now and now you can see uh, this lines of code okay now save it to run any uh, test case you have to click on the date case uh, dead test case go to run as and just run as normal java application okay so once you run so you can see now google browser has opened okay so let's conclude these things first what i did in this one now we have to invoke a browser okay so for invoking a browser what we did we just created one class any test cases is present inside this src folder only just remember okay just remember this lecture so from the next lecture you can understand what i'm going to tell each and every test cases will be created inside this src folder first thing second thing uh whenever we start anything okay either browsing like anything okay so first we have to hit the browser to hitting a browser we have to create this driver this object okay object driver object so how to create this driver object with the help of this one okay web driver driver goes to new chrome driver this lines of uh, is sufficient to create a object and with the help of this one driver dot so you can get this get is a method okay get is a method to hit the url okay and the last we are adding two second slip time so this is the code okay so hope you guys understand these things okay if not then in the second lecture okay we will discuss about these things more clear and then we will see okay so again i am running it just save it right click run as java application so you will see like the google chrome has opened here okay so in this we uh, like i think like this is okay for this video okay so we will see in another lecture okay what we can do further with these things okay so guys so happy learning and bye bye